Craig Cameron here, and in this series of videos, I'm gonna desensitize and show you how to make a brave horse. Well, good morning, Craig Cameron here, and uh, coming to you from the old Cedar Corral here on the Double Horn Ranch, and uh, just turn this horse loose in here. And I'm not asking him to go anywhere, he's just pretty fresh, but uh, this morning I'm gonna do some really interesting work, and it's some work that I do on a kind of an everyday basis. Uh, something that would help you and your horses. I think you're gonna really wanna stay tuned. I'm gonna show you some techniques that I use for making kind of a gentle, calm, brave type of horse. So I'm gonna expose this horse to quite a few things here uh, without overexposing him. So to just gain his confidence, get him more sure, get him to where he feels safe. So if you have a horse that's nervous and apprehensive and unsure, a little bit spooky, chargy, this is the kind of work that gives them some place to go, something to do that's gonna relax these horses, not only physically, but mentally and emotionally. Hey, I think you're gonna like it, and we're gonna get started. All right, this is uh, not a bad horse here. The lady dropped her off because she wants this horse uh, to be taken further and not be so spooky. Every time she goes to get on, she says she's nervous because this horse is really spooky. You know, he acts like he wants to buck and does buck sometimes. So where I'm going to start is right back at the beginning. But I'm going to show you some great techniques that you can use on an everyday basis. You know, I'm going to show you how to start the horse and then later on in the series, how you use this kind of work on an everyday basis. So this horse was running around a minute ago. That was wonderful. I like to get the fresh off of them, but I'm going to start now just getting this horse to catch up a little bit. Then I'm going to work. Uh, the again head neck shoulder rib cage uh, right down on the feet and then from there we're going to continue on with a lot of different things so let's let's kind of just send this horse off now and start earning some respect so off we go and you can see as soon as i did that boy that head came up and that horse got a little unsure so watch i'm going to just step in front of him here here and just kind of cut this pin in half and really Put this horse to work. Really put this horse to work. Here, here, put him to work. Where maybe I can gain his attention a little bit and, and get to where I can, there, there, here. See, almost, almost, and I'm watching this horse now. Here, there, good, there. And what am I looking for? I'm looking for a change in this horse. And how do I know when he's getting ready? I'm paying attention, really paying attention to his eyes and his ears, you know, the tilt of his head, his body position, his expression, his demeanor, is his head up, is his head down, or his ears back, or his eyes just open, not blinking, is he tight-lipped, not licking his lips, holding his breath. These are the things you need to be aware of. So. This pause here, really important. This horse came to me. So that's the whole idea. Teach that horse to catch, earn that understanding, earn that respect. Watching that horse, observing this horse. Even the most minute, minute and tiniest detail, details. So I'm gonna get ready to send him off again. I'm gonna have my flag over here. Just getting him more sure. Have my flag over here, over here. You see, again, he gets a little nervous right there. Well, I mean, right quick, he's like unsure what we're doing. Here, here, here. And I'm just gonna step in his eye. Here, shh. because he didn't look at me, I'm gonna drive him again. Watch how I step into his eye here. And he seems to be a little bit better to the left, which is so common right there because we handle the horses on the left. So I'm gonna walk up, put that pause in there, where he can think about what just happened. I'm rewarding him for coming to me. Here, and he wants to keep me, look, in that left eye. When I step over here, he puts his eye over here. He says, I'm comfortable with you in that left eye. So I'm aware of that. You need to be aware of that. He, he matter of fact, he really blocks me over on this right side. So I'm gonna come over here, rub on this horse, pet on this horse, and then I'm gonna send this horse off. 
When I send the horse off, I'm ready to step backwards because a lot of times they'll leave with a kick. So let's see, see, look at this horse. As soon as I go to work, he gets really nervous. Here, and I'm gonna work on this right side a little bit. I'm gonna work on this right side. Here, I'm just trying to bring that horse to me. Draw that horse to me. Better, just like that. And that's a nice change, and that's a nice start.